Guam Regional Transit Authority Chief Planner Felix Berto Dunga says there are several major projects underway for 2013. Among these projects is the $1.5 million procurement grant for eight paratransit buses and four fixed route buses. GRTA is also hoping to finalize by mid this year a long-term transit contract and the creation of a one-call, once-click center. The remaining 300000 of our grant is to create uh, and staff a one-call, one-click center. And that's a central dispatching because right now you have several um, entities who provide transportation. Dunga anticipates the one-call, once-click center and the Guam Regional Transit Authority to be housed in the same building. In addition to these projects, the agency plans to implement new expanded transit routes early this year that will provide service to areas in Guam that were not serviced before. Along with expanded routes, GRTA will implement new schedules. The hours of service will be extended from 5.30 a.m. to 7.30 p.m. Dunga says the four-hour gap between services, which was an issue for riders, will also be addressed, shortening that gap to a two-hour period, providing riders with more hours of service Monday through Saturday. Revise the the bus routes and schedules uh, because there's a lot of shortfalls in the current services we, we offer. So we completed that through a series of meetings, we revised the entire schedule. Mm -hmm. uh, those schedules are going to go up for three public hearings. The new transit routes and schedules are scheduled to go into effect on March 1st. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Jolene Tobin.